One of my favorite objects in the archives is the International District After Dawn, a documentary produced by the Seattle Department of Community Development in 1984. The district has had to cope with a history of disruptions and intrusions on community life dating to its origin. The construction of Interstate 5 and the Kingdom created a physical and psychological barrier as they split the community from the rest of Seattle. Following the murders of cannery labor activists and the Wami massacre in the early 1980s, negative press coverage critically impacted the Chinatown International District community. The media depicted the neighborhood as dangerous, resulting in decreased patronage of CID businesses. In an effort to reshape public perception and promote the rich culture, vibrant community, and successful local businesses in the neighborhood, the Department of Community Development's Office of Urban Conservation partnered with the International Special Review District Board to develop a public relations program which included an annual report, a walking tour for the press, and this video. Philip Fuji spearheaded the project, and the group conducted a survey to gather feedback from community stakeholders. The video follows various CID residents, community activists, and business owners on an average day. Prominent members of the community are interviewed about their work and efforts to restore the neighborhood, including Bob Santos, Suta Oka, Irene Wu, and Ron Chu, all of which either served on or contributed to the work of the International Special Review District Board over the years. The narrative highlights various ways that the community has overcome challenges and continues to thrive. All facets of the neighborhood are featured, such as social services, healthcare, dining, retail, arts and culture, entertainment, and preservation of historic buildings. The documentary originally aired on local news channel King 5 and was screened for CID residents at the Bush Asia Center. Being able to know the people who live here has, has enriched my life and I just don't see, regardless of where I am, it actually being very far from, from the district because by being here, it just kind of winds up in your heart. The footage shows sweeping views of the city skyline, offering a glimpse into how much not only the Chinatown International District, but all of Seattle has changed over the past 40 years. To view this and other archival footage of the CID, please visit seattle.gov slash cityarchives.